Hello, this is Capsert, and in this video I'm going to show you the Beppy the Clown quick kill on regular difficulty. I use the roundabout plus with lobo weapon combination, it's spread on roundabout and will probably work as well. For this glitch to happen, you must deal enough damage in phase 1 to actually skip phase 2. A great <laughs> when the fight starts, you instantly walk slightly towards the clown and start spamming your weapon swap button. During the first wiggle, make sure you're getting quite a bit of damage, but your damage must not equal more than 1.5 X cards, as that would trigger the second phase to start. The closer you get to 1.5 cards, however, the better. Here go. When you notice the boss starts his charge animation, get ready to jump. This might require some practice. Make sure you don't jump too high to avoid hitting the ducks, but still be high enough to dash over the boss. Once he charges at you, jump and dash over the boss. Turn around and start using your weapon swap again. I personally tend to mix in some EX abilities as well. I calculated that in a TAS this would be increased damage and I feel this shouldn't be any different in a human mage weapon swap cycle. Make sure you get the boss to at least 3.5 cards of EX uh, damage. Keep in mind that the number of cards will be one less for each EX ability you used. You can continue hitting the boss as he jumps off his card. When you see the explosions in the background, this means you have successfully skipped the second phase. You can now continue attacking invisible hitfoxes in the middle of the screen. Make sure you avoid the projectiles and the train coming at you until it says knockout though, because that's when the fight is over. This skip is pretty much consistent when you follow this tutorial. The only problem that could come in is when he does two relatively short wiggles before charging. Two short wiggles won't give you enough time to deal damage, but this where RNG is rather rare. Preferably the boss starts with a short wiggle, followed by a long wiggle before his second charge. I hope this tutorial was useful. Thanks for watching and good luck with your practice.